Lunges in pregnancy are awesome if you can continue to do them throughout pregnancy. Just doing some unilateral strength, getting that hip shift, sometimes allows baby to move into place later on. Uh, great core, great everything, okay? So lunge throughout pregnancy if you can. If you can't, I know personally, I get really bad case of pubic symphysis dysfunction during pregnancy, which is where your pubic bone ligament, ligament meets, gets really shifty and loosey-goosey, and it causes a lot of pain during hip shifts. All my pubic symphysis dysfunction girlies out there, I feel you. I'm not gonna talk about that specifically today. I talk about that more in my Bells and Bumps program, but I'm just gonna talk about general terms, lunging during pregnancy, and a couple of options, especially later in pregnancy, if and when they get tricky. First of all, real quick general lunge form. My default is the reverse lunge, but a lot of these things will apply to if you're doing forward lunges, um, walking lunges, what have you. So, we wanna start up tall, hips under, ribs in, and maintain the hips under, ribs in as we step back, pull our back knee to the floor, inhale down, push off of the front foot, exhale up. So we wanna avoid that butt sticking out, we wanna avoid a super long leg here in the back, we wanna keep everything pretty dang tall, and if you're working body weight, inhale down, exhale up, and make sure you're working those hands. So opposite hand comes up with that front leg. Um, my favorite go-to hold is gonna be the goblet hold. If you wanna add load, grab the horns, pull off the chest, elbows in. Also a racked kettlebell hold. So knuckles to ceiling, elbow to floor, nice firm wrist. Um, but if lunges are getting challenging, but you want to keep lunging, at this point you're probably dropping the weight. Couple of great, Modifiers for the lunge, maybe the weight of belly third trimester is plenty of load for you, then this would be it for you. So a great way to assist lunges is just pushing off of something, a chair, a bench, something a little bit high, and just take that inside leg back and you could push off of it just to have a little bit of assistance up. Another lifesaver during pregnancy is a suspension trainer. So you're gonna set it up at hip height walk it back, elbows by the side, tension on suspension, and then same dance, we just wanna extend the arms, don't totally let go here, stay nice and tall, shoulders roll back, kiss that knee to the floor, and then you have that little assist, that little pull up, but we still get to say hello to those muscles in this range of motion that is really important to be able to maintain during pregnancy. So I hope that helps, lunge on, live epic, be epic.